Scalpers in Cincinnati were charging more than a thousand bucks for tickets to the All-Star Game tonight. But in baseball, some of the best seats can be the most dangerous. Here's Dean Reynolds. At every game, fans scramble for balls as if they were priceless gems. But viewed from a less sentimental perspective, some fans in the area calling for help. Cork-centered baseballs can pose a serious danger. At last Friday's Red Sox-Yankees game, shortstop Didi Gregarious lined a ball into the stands right at Stephanie Wapensky's face. I saw the ball and it hit me all in such a split second, I barely had time to process what was coming. She received 30 stitches. Last month, also at Fenway, Tanya Carpenter was hit in the head by a broken bat and remains hospitalized. About 1,700 fans are injured by bats and balls at Major League games every year. 1,701 if this young fan had not been alert. Here at Wrigley Field, all the tickets to Cubs games have a warning on the back in fine print about batted balls and broken bats. But listen to the warning for tonight's All-Star game. Attendance at the game is, it says, voluntary and may result in personal injury, including death. The players' union is fine with extending the protective netting as the Arizona Diamondbacks have done, but most teams still leave prime foul ball territory and their fans exposed. A seat with an unobstructed view is terrific, but the price can be high. Dean Reynolds, CBS News, Chicago. And that's the CBS Evening News for tonight. For all of us at CBS News all around the world, good night.